I'm Tim with Strictly Ceilings. In this session, we'll show you how to build a ceiling drop at the bottom of a stairwell for increased headroom. First, assess your stairwell and install as much of the lower wall angle as possible. Remember to have at least a two. Here's a tip for you. When cutting a main that extends into the slope of the stairwell like this one does, be sure to add plenty of extra onto the end, taking in consideration. Try to use a T that lines up with the grid layout for the beginning of the slope. If the T is not where you want it or there is no T running perpendicular to the slope, you will have to straighten the T by measuring at both ends, making sure the measurement is the same and rivet the T in the place. Cut the angle and install the piece riveting the end up against the perpendicular T first. Measure to the edge of the T on the bottom of the slope and add 3 eighths of an inch. Cut your tile length and then on the side that is the bottom of the slope. The rest is easy. Simply measure, cut and install all the remaining border pieces and finish by installing any full tiles that are needed. 